So essentially you are using this script. The government is giving away money to go solar. Let's see what you're entitled to. Here, um, you can toggle this on and send them an email with the report. And you can also send one to yourself. But before we do that, we're gonna leave these off and we're just gonna calculate the solar incentives. So let's just say a solar system is gonna cost 100,000 and they are married filing jointly and they make $150,000 a year. And if they are in an energy community area, what we're gonna do is we're gonna type in an address here and you can hit control A, which copies the whole field, control C, which copies, and then you go to the Department of Energy map and you hit okay. And then you hit the search button here. You type in the address and you hit, uh, oh, find the address and you hit it. And then basically any area that is shaded in, oops. Purple or green is a energy community area. And that would qualify for the 10%. What is an energy community area? It's a, it's a coal mine, it's an oil field area, it's a area that's hit with unemployment. And so it's defined by the Department of Energy due to uh, Joe Manchin's bill. He was looking for more of the appellation, but we got all these extra areas here that qualify for the 10% energy community area if you uh, are using commercial, which we are, even on a home residential system. So if they qualify for the area, we would put yes. And then you could also figure any state, local, and utility incentives. You can check the Desire USA website. And it's a good idea to um, know this website and check your local utility areas to find what other incentives are available locally. Okay? But we don't handle that. You have to do that because they're always changing. They run out of money, but there are some awesome state, local, and utility incentives available. So once that's done, you hit submit and you get your numbers. It gets popped into your download area. You can save it. Um, and then you get to look at the numbers and it says here, okay. So we have the solar system cost, solar investment, energy community, solar tax max benefit, which is basically the extra money we're going to get you with our plan, uh, along with the energy community bonus. And so here you have your total solar incentives. And then the net solar cost on this project would be 47,000. So now let me show you the energy banking portion. So first you'd show this to the homeowner, Mr. Homeowner. Look, I work with a company called Solar Tax Pros. They're the industry leader. We're going to help you make sure you get all your solar incentives back. They're, they're a tax and accounting firm. And so this is what you're entitled to. Isn't that amazing? We can get you 50% of your project costs reimbursed back to you. So your net solar cost in this example will only be 47000 Now, if we go to the energy banking calculator below, you see that that number here populates right in here to the net solar costs. And you ask the homeowner, what's your average electric bill? What's your average auto fuel bill? What's your monthly solar payment? I like to use zero because I want to show them how to pay cash for their system. Even if you finance it, I'd say you know, 10, 11, 12% with no dealer fee. We like that best. You're going to have um, no monthly solar payment. And so average annual inflation rate, you can change this number. I leave it at five. Investment rate of return, the S&P 500 index has been averaging 10% for the last 50 and 100 years. And then whatever the minimum connection fee is to the grid, just to be fair. And so, as you can see, Mr. Homeowner, would you agree that $200 of electric bill and $200 of auto fuel bill is $400 a month, which is 
$4,800 a year. And with inflation, that's going to be $27,000 you'll have spent on energy over a five-year period and $63,000 over a 10-year period that you're going to be wasting. What do you think would happen if you save that money in a Roth IRA that grows tax-free and average 10%? Well, here's what's going to happen. You could have $34,000 saved in your bank account in five years, or you could spend $27,000 doing what you're doing now and not using solar to your advantage. Okay. Like I said, the government's giving away money to go solar. They're begging you to go solar and it's not going to last forever. The price of solar is going to go up. I promise you. So now's the time to take advantage, okay? So look here, Mr. Mr. Homeowner, you could spend $240,000 over 25 years, or you could save $771,000 in your bank account. Which column is better for you? Now, if they have any questions about this, we have a breakout of the numbers by year and a little bit more of a breakout so you can see the, the monthly and the annual and the year one and the cumulative energy. As you can see here, year five, you add them all up, you add all these up and you get 27,849. Now, if you were to take the, the connection fee, right? And, and let's say the connection fee grows by inflation, but you have no solar bill or no cumulative solar bill because you, you paid cash for this, you have solar savings. so. Mr. Homeowner, by buying solar, you're literally earning 9% on your money, on your investment to go solar. Plus, you've increased the value of your home and the government gave you a whole bunch of money back, right? So we've added up all of the annual returns here and essentially invested them. And so in five years, you can have $34,000 saved in your bank account. You let this thing grow and you have in 50 years, almost $11 million saved in your own Roth IRA bank account, simply by transforming the way you acquire energy. You create it for free from the sun. You get an electric vehicle. You eliminate your auto fuel bills now. And this makes all the sense in the world. So if you have questions, all you have to do is with your, when you're with the homeowner, is book a phone a friend call, if phone the tax expert right here, and just schedule a call with us, and we get right on the phone with you and that homeowner. And so let's go ahead and schedule a call for one o'clock, check out the system. You're gonna put the homeowner's information here. Stay happy. And then we're gonna put, uh, I confirm, and schedule emergency tax advisor, boom. And you're scheduled. We will be calling you right away. So when you report the sale, that means you close the sale with the tax max plan. We're gonna have a, a new button here inside the calculator, but um, we need you to report the sale so we know what's going on there. Uh, we can reach out to the homeowner and start um, with their plan. Okay. So that's how you use the solar tax max calculator and energy banking calculator to your benefit. If you have any questions, feel free to join us on Wednesdays at 12 o'clock for the live Q and a call. Thanks for watching.